Welcome back, everybody. Happy Memorial Day. And if you're like me, I already ate a lot of food this past weekend. And today there's going to be barbecues as well. People getting together with family and friends going to be celebrating with food again today. We want to work that off. All right. So here's some preparation to deal with that. Eric is back with us. How are you? Good morning. Good. Pretty good. Have good. Yourself. Good, good. And Claire is uh, has changed her clothes. She is all yep. fitted, uh, fitted up here. <laughs> all right. So we got we're doing fitness balls this morning, right? Yeah, stability balls, Swiss balls, whatever you know. The name changes a lot, but they're all the same thing. It's just you know these nice household objects. You know, and you find your gym. And yeah. Really easy. Just a ball, pretty yeah. much. Yeah. Well. Whenever I use these, it, I'm just doing sit-ups. That's all I do. You know, I don't really know what else you can do with it. I'm also scared of losing my balance on it. Yeah. <laughs> so tell us, what, what are kind of some things you can do? So we, you can do a lot of things. You can do a bunch of leg exercises on them. You can do a bunch of core exercises. What the, their benefit is, is they provide an a instability. And we're working those stabilizing muscles that we want to really kind of focus on so that we can work those big muscles safely. Okay. All right. Okay. So we're gonna actually going to do some sit-ups on some today. I like to give a variety. But we're going to do a good core workout for your abs, a good little core set of um, about five exercises that we're going to do today. And it's going to be a nice little thing, fun thing you can do at home or at the gym. Yeah. Add, to your, add to the end of your workout, beginning of your workout, however you want to add it in there. Claire, how's your balance? Are, how, how are you going to do? Good. Yeah? I, I do like balancing. I've used these before. So, but I don't know. I haven't used it at this early in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> let's see how it goes. All right, let's see it. What's right. the first thing? So we're gonna we're gonna first we're gonna sit on this ball. Again, you can use this. You know, if you ever you know if you have a desk job, you can use it as a seat. You know, as, oh, as yeah. replace your chair every once in a while, just kind of get your posture better. Um, but sit on it. I roll down so you're small. Your back's on that. So again, if you have you know if you're ever at a gym and you need to like to put the wall in front of you, you can kind of stabilize your feet against that wall. But you roll down, small your back. So in this position, your abs should be on tight. So I want this. This is you know you're stabilizing here. You know you have to really work that core. And here we're going to do is just sit ups, just basic. So when I do my sit ups, I want to create length through my abs. So I want to create length going back because we always think about crunching forward, but really what our abs really want to work on is we want to create length. They work the hardest when we're going back, and then we sit on up nice and tall, keep those abs tight. So we go length and back, come back up. Looks like you're arching a rainbow over and back, and back on up. And again, to create more length, we go ahead and bring the hands right behind the head. Again, we lengthen back, and come on back up. Good, nice little set. You can go ahead and do 10 of these, you know, <laughs> with your workout. Yeah. And then you're gonna go ahead, and we're, I like to go ahead and lengthen it back so we reach back with that shoulder over that shoulder and come back up and then we reach back over the shoulder again creating length so you want to create like an x across your abdominals so moving your hand back past your uh, your yes. head that that helps it helps with length. length because we also don't want to use the chest and the shoulders to help get ourselves up we want to keep that concentrate in that middle of that body so we want to stay central so again creating this hand back again reduces that use of those of the arms to power yourself back up so we can stay concentrated in the middle of that body. Okay. What else yeah. you got for us? And then we're going to go ahead, you finish out that set, create those lengths, do a few of those sit-ups, warm those abs up, and then we flip that ball around again. And now we really get to the instability portion. So we're going to go, we have that plank on the ground, but you can really, you know, make that plank better by using it on the ball. So go ahead, come on to that plank on that ball. You hold it strong. Again, you don't want your back to arch, so make sure that your butt's level with your shoulders here, abs are tight. And then we, again, we want to create more instability. We kind of move that ball around. So you can do circles. Claire, are you okay over there? <laughs> and again, <laughs> again, both directions, circles, or, you know, if you want to have some fun with it, you just kind of write your name out. So, oh. you know, write your name out any old way. Make sure you do it forward and backwards. Cause you know, we always want to be balanced as we do that. Again, nice drawn plank on there. And then what I like to really do to really kind of really power those abs is then you come on up and you bring this ball underneath those legs. Oh my goodness. Oh, yeah. Again, in this plank, again, working that balance. Abs gotta be on tight. Don't wanna arch that back. Keep that strong plank. And you can do tucks here. Wow. Again, tucking in those abs. You can do push-ups here in between. <laughs> and then, you know, for the super balance, this is, again, advanced move. You can go into a pike. You pike straight Whoa. on up and come on back down. And you can kind of rotate through. You can do a pike, to a push up, to a tuck. Again, really working that core, total body. You know, yeah. nice little use of that stability ball, medicine, uh, <laughs> Swiss ball. Yeah. 
fitness ball, whatever you want to call it. Eric, thank you so much. So many different things you can yes. work out with your body. I didn't know that you can do all those things. I've never seen anybody do that at the gym. <laughs> so I guess everybody's scared of their balance, but hey, that will help you so much, it looks like, right? Yes, it will. It will really kind of get your body in, in the optimum shape that you want it to be in. All right, good. All right. Claire, good job. Thanks, <laughs> <laughs> all right, everybody, thanks for joining us this Memorial Day. Have a great day, and uh, shout out to all the veterans out there who have served our country. Have a great day.